Here we are. We have made it to... Oh, well, that was an accident. That was my shadow of the wind or whatever that's called. Yeah, shadow of the wind. Um, anyway, so we can sink really well right now. Hi there. Hi there, weird looking creature, I pet you. Anyway, we are here at our current location, yes. Uh, the Myrid Tower at the Heartland's border. Gonna take ourselves a, a trial. So, we gotta go talk to some people. There's a strong t chest. Good evening. The keeper, yeah, yeah. Anything going on in this tower, though, before we get going? Before we get crack a lack and ooh, a bed. Teleport to Ark, some potatoes. I'm gonna sleep. I'm gonna sleep for, I'd say, a good five hours. Just a quick rest. A little kipper. Kipperoo. And we're awake. So, full disclosure. Um, on my way out of Ark, discovered a couple locations on the way here. Because I ran the whole way. So much to do, so little time. Indeed. And we leveled up. Uh, we leveled up. We leveled up our um, mana. And we also chose the kind of... The mana-focused path, which I believe is called Focus, if I remember correctly. Something like that. Anyway, you there. Yes. Uh, Grandmaster Aranthiol sent me. I'm supposed to take the trial to become a keeper? I'm Ron Burgundy? Oh, yes. You're the prodigy. The fire starter! I was expecting Twisted something else. I hope you're aware of what you're getting yourself into. Our novices train for years for this trial. And as much as I respect the Grand Master, I think this is naive. In other words, it will be dangerous. Be aware of that. Okay. Let's calm down. Let's let's just skip that chatter. How about we do that? Huh. If you insist. I do. Uh, then it seems I'm granted the extraordinary honor of exalting the first pathless in the history of the order to a keeper. The others will scream for joy. <sighs> Give me the package the Grand Master gave you and say hello to your new comrades. I have to go prepare something. Okay. So we got the other examinees right here. Hello, Kalia? Kalia? Salia? Something like that? What? Oh, hello. Hello. You're our unexpected addition, aren't you? Yes. The prodigy? What is a power? <laughs> I love prodigy. <laughs> uh, yes, but uh, call me Deanne Holman. Sounds less awkward that way. It does, actually. Yeah, she likes it. I'm Kalia Sakarish. By my path, novice and aspirant to the first sigil. Aspirin? I have been told what you did in old Rationgrad. That you saved the excavations and fought back the mercenaries all on your own. An astonishing feat, truly. You have my respect for that. Well, uh, okay. Good trouble wherever I go. <laughs> Save the excavation. Yes, but the people from your order were already dead. That's true, that's true. I know. Oh, she likes but that you too. Tried. You know, too I'm really time. curious as to what the mercenaries thought they were doing. Someone willing to attack the Holy Order is either extremely powerful or extremely naive. Anyway, it's been an honor to meet you in person. Let's talk later. Indeed. You seem cool. <laughs> All right. Hello there, you strapping young elven creature. I don't want to hear it. I beg your damn pardon. You're prattling. I don't want to hear it. Just shove off. What's your, what's your problem? You have to ask. This country is going downhill, and you are living proof of it, my friend. First, Neremi's wild mages are allowed to walk on the holy temple grounds as if it were some kind of brothel. Then mercenaries are hired, and now 
you and Outlander, a pathless, are able to be initiated into the sigils of the Holy Order. We've trained for years to stand here, and until now, I thought that this country respected its traditions. That's my problem. Now get out of my sight. Well, he All right. hello Enough to you too. Chatter. Come here. Jackass. <laughs> Alright, yo. Segged it. Later. He's busy, clearly. Here. These potions will be necessary later, so be careful with them. Apart from that, it's still a few miles to the ritual place. As you're all gifted with magic, the spores in the forest ahead will make you a little dizzy, but we won't stay for long. Any questions? Well, how about you, uh, tell me what these spores are? It's, what are you talking about, exactly? <sighs> long story. Simply put, they come from a special kind of mushroom that has infested this forest, and staying near them worsens the Arcanist's fever. So, in case you're thinking about exploring further, take some magical protection and some ambrosia with you. Hey, look at that. Collect 10 knowledge points. As your reward, you receive a permanent bonus of your skills, a bonus which can get stronger when you gather more knowledge. Noise. Blessing of the Wise, rank 1, added to the spell book. Alright then, let's go. Good. Stay close to me. Alright. Don't see anything there. Let's see. We have a Blessing of the Wise. Let's see. No. No? Okay. So it's in a spell book. I didn't know we had a spell book, to be perfectly honest. Just saying. <laughs> anyway, yo, I'm here. Let's go. Rock you like a hurricane. Come on. Come on, come on, come on! Let's do a little parkour. Hooch! But it's too late for that. Alrighty then. Hey! Huh? I just had another vision. <sighs> oh, did you now? So, what did you see? A horde of naked Skarag women charging towards us? Wish. No, I... Okay, look. You're very impressive and talented, I get it. But please, spare me this rubbish about visions and echoes of the future. Teolor always had a fondness for those kind of things, but I'm not really one for all that. So, let's keep going. Fair enough. Fair enough. Hmm, what's all this? Alright. A drill? I'm sure these things could possibly come in handy. Mm -hmm. So this is the Whispering Forest. Yeah, yeah, so, so it is. Fascinating. I've read a lot about it, but never actually seen it. Poor thing. My brothers and I have seen the border countless many times before. But I bet you know all about the Undercity's rat holes instead. What a dick. Capital D. Oh, what's this? Okay, that looks like a Charis. Prepare yourself. Puss beetle. Get ready. Let's fight. Let's go. Oh, I'm too old for this. <laughs> too old for this shit. <laughs> I got an arrow back. All right. Fair enough. All right. Well, I'm just gonna keep following you. Oh, these are, these must be the shrooms he was speaking of. 
Rose 2, 26%. Oh. Right there. Prepare yourself. Ow! Where did the jackass go? Hey! Uh, just leave it up to us girls. Typical man, right, ladies? That was all of them. Alright. Couple arrows. Just ran away and hid. Us girls stick together. <laughs> Wait, do you see that? What am I looking yes, at? That man. What is he doing? Oh. Well, let's go say hi. He shouldn't be here. No merchant in his right mind would voluntarily travel through the whispering forest. We'll go take a look at him. Stay ready. Oh, I'm ready. See, I got my bow. Okay. She's with me now. Forever. Kirash. What is you there? Who are you? And what are you doing here? Donkey. I love me some parfait. Okay. She's with me now. Forever. What are you, deaf? Identify yourself. Alright, just say the word. Eyes. Master, this is the Red Madness. Shit. Say the course. word and it's over. You will put away that pickaxe right now, my sir, and then get on your knees. She wanted to leave. Don't you understand? Give me the word. She wanted to leave me. Even with Just the staff like coming that. through. This is no. disgusting. She will stay. She will stay. Whoa! By the righteous past, have you lost your mind? I could ask you the same thing, damn it. Did you forget what Magister Yero did to the novices? This Just give me the word. Oh, let's end this. Oh, really? Malthus protect us from your cunning. <laughs> she, the she's giving us the mind that not now kind of look. A disease <laughs> in order to heal it. And that say the word. Carry might have given their left hand for a living patient. This, you're not being fair, Master. <laughs> I, I was only protecting us. Oh, yeah. You behave like an idiot, and not for the first time. The other masters might ignore that fact due to your religious commitment and your bloodline. I get that. But if something like this ever happens again, you will be suspended from the rites and will spend the rest of your life polishing prayer banks in the sanctum. Do I make myself clear? He really was trying to protect us, Master. Maybe... Do I make myself clear? Tell him. You. You do, Master. And I beg your forgiveness for my offense. Granted. Now let's push on. We will take care of the body after the ritual. Fair enough. Okay. Just, just give me the, give me a word. Oh, right in his face. Okay. I hope I get to kill him. Are you okay? Just save it. Sharim Ralita 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 Glimmer Dust. More Glimmer Dust. We'll have to check out what that does later. Thought I heard a wolfie. I want to know what this is. They're going off somewhere. Ooh. Fancy flames. Purple glowing light. <laughs> right, I guess they're stopping. <laughs> I'm exploring. Okay. This looks interesting. Oh, here they come. Oh, hey guys, I found the it. first <laughs> foothold. This is where Malthus's vassals erected their first camp. So behave yourselves accordingly. You too, prodigy. Smack my bitch up. <laughs> Oh, 
Well then, before we start, there's something I need to tell you. Something, uh, important. The rumors concerning the deaths of the Lightborn, they're true. What? The gods are dead. They fell two winters ago beneath the sword of an unknown traveler. We, uh, that is, the Order, have known about this for quite some time now, but haven't told the common people yet. But since the two, uh, the three of you intend to take the trial, there's no way to disguise the truth anymore. But how can a god die? Uh, there was a prophecy, as old as the Lightborn themselves, in which there was talk of a shadow god who would end the era of gods. And it came true. I'm sorry. You're sorry? You're telling us that the gods have been killed, and you are sorry. What's next? That tomorrow the sun will stop shining? Tell us that... that this is a test, Master. It is, isn't it? A test of our faith. No. The Lightborn are dead. But... Hard as it may be to accept, we cannot afford we? to fall into a spiritual crisis right now. We... The Order of the Gods, Malthus's Order, was created to protect the Lightborn. And if what you're saying, this... this blasphemy is true, then we're meaningless. We failed, don't you see that? Oh, by the Black Guardian, I... I just can't believe it. And though I shan't be seen, thou shalt live by my virtue. Third Revelation, verse 137. I know it's hard, Dunwar, but if this is true, we have to show strength and keep on believing in what the Lightborn stood for. Which is the idea of peace and... Oh, just shut your mouth, Sakaresh. If anything, you lowborn scum are living proof that the Order is going downhill. Do you really think I don't know about the village? You're a damned witch, and if this were the old times, you would have been crucified long time ago. You don't mean that, Dunwar. Drop it, for heaven's sake! We're all on the same side here. No, we are not. This wench doesn't have any right to wear the white robes. And if you would spend more time with the holy scriptures instead of your brandy bottle, you would see it as well. But no, you just... Shut up! I swear to you, one more word and you will wish that I just suspended you. But... No buts! Do you understand? Yes. <sighs> I hope so, for your sake. <sighs> Just be glad that this is a time when we need skilled mages more than ever. Just be glad. Now enough of this. Our demeanor defiles this sacred place. There will be enough time for depression and personal crisis after the trial. <sighs> Let's recite the holy words. Thou art my light, my glimmer at the horizon. Thy name is my sacrament, and thy path I will honor. In life, as in death. May, May your light, your guide, light me. guide me. Good. As you know, this trial will test the fortitude of your spirit. Because this is what... Um, Distinguishes a keeper from a soldier. What distinguishes a wise man from a fool. Keep that in mind. Now, drink the potion I gave you. You first, prodigy. Let's hope the Grand Master was right about you. We're awake. Somebody. Oh no. No, no, no. I knew I wouldn't be the last one. Did they also tell you the tales about the Keeper's spirit? They've lured you into a trap, you know. And you fell for it. Because you're arrogant. Just as I am. As I was. You're not real, are you? Oh, of course not. At least not according to your definition of the word. 
But then again, what is reality anyway? If I told you that you and your friend Sirius actually lie dead at the bottom of the sea, and that everything that has happened so far, your journey to Ark, the search at the Sun Coast, was only a dream, would you be able to recognize the truth? The answer is no. Because you don't want to be dead. Therefore, your mind will do anything to make you believe this entire dream you've had was and is reality. <sighs> Doesn't it? Tell me, what is time to the dead and dreaming anyway? The last second before the water floods into your lungs. The very last instant before it tears them apart. In your mind, it could be an eternity. A self-created sanctuary built from nothing but your wishes. But what's the point in talking anyway? You don't want to believe me. And I'm tired of trying to make you. Now leave me alone, before we make the suppressor even angrier. He doesn't like words. He likes the silence. The suppressor? Who are you talking about? What? They haven't told you about him? Oh, that's so typical. The suppressor. He's the reason why we will be imprisoned here forever. And why we can't access our feelings and wishes. And he does it because he wants us to lose hope, to stop believing. And, you know, sometimes I wonder if that's exactly what we humans, what I have to do to finally be free. Give up. Detach myself from the dreams of the past. Who knows if there were anything else than phantasms to begin with. But no. No, not yet. It's too early to surrender. And isn't that what makes us human anyway? To hope? And to just keep on waiting for that one miracle that will end the pain once and for all? Yeah. Yeah, I'll wait. And you will wait with me forever. All right, <clears throat> things did get strange. And we're, we don't have any of our stuff. I'm, uh, well, we got, we have no gear. We have our spells that we've learned though. How did you do that? I wish I knew. <laughs> to be perfectly honest. You... simply opened it? But that's impossible. All these years it's kept me from escaping and you just... Come, come on. We... We have to look. We, we have to look and see what's outside. We won't get far, but... But still, we... We have to see. Come, lead the way. All right. This is rather strange. <gasps> Requires key! Sounds like someone or something breathing almost. A little floating chair. Yeah, that's cool. Oh. <laughs> Something's coming. <laughs> Alright, use my shadow of the wind. Could 
come in handy. I'm gonna just favorite that for right now. I'm gonna favorite that too. I really want to try this dark power, even though it's gonna hurt me. Oh, jeez. A seducer. <laughs> I'm gonna, I can admit, that was a little creepy. <laughs> it's like Creepy Watson. I got goosebumps right now. This is... Damn awesome. Let me save real quick. I, it's like, I don't know why, but something coming at you like that that doesn't make a noise is much creepier than... Aah! There's the whole jump scare tactic involved, but... At least it didn't hurt him. <laughs> hey, good job, mod maker, on this. <laughs> oh, something's looking. Good old one two combo. These are the scourges of the suppressor. They want to punish us. We're not gonna let them. Sweet. Alright. Human flesh. Man flesh. <laughs> So that's a switch of some kind. Some written paper. Silence what really drives you. Are you opposite of what you really are? Destructive, strong, powerful, meaningful, and short the profits. You've constructed a narrative for yourself, a fairy tale, a fairy tale about who you want to be. And you have found exactly those people who confirm it. That's the most important thing, isn't it? You found someone who believes in your fairy tale. Don't you see? You're Simply wrong. <laughs> All about you is wrong. You're pathetic. Weak, pathetic fool. You know that? What would Sirius say about this? Alright, for curiosity's sake. If we could sit in that chair as it was floating. <laughs> Horseshoe, no thanks. I did not. Vagrant gloves. All right. Getting armor piece by piece. Just keep going.
I'm gonna just take all the flesh. Does that make me creepy? Eh. Who's the who's the, who are you to judge? Man, I gotta go down here and check this out. Oh, here they come. Come on. There you are. Okay. I'm gonna save. Just in case. I wonder if we can take that bow. There's a sword. So far, we're okay. Right, we can go. Let's go through. More crusty bread, flesh, and hearts and stuff, probably. expected. Can't take the axe. That's a shame. Take that. Yeah. Okay. What? No. Interesting. Another written paper. Who are you? Okay, that's the same thing. Okay. It's very not Skyrim, and I thoroughly enjoy it. I was kind of hoping it would let us go through. Nope. All right. Let's keep going. Keep going. Yeah, I see ya. Oof. Got a little sneak attack there? Yes. Alright, that looks... <sighs> it's so cold. Maybe it wasn't such a good idea to go out. After all, I mean... I mean, yeah. Yes, the cell is small, but... At least it's... Safe. Well, you do make a point of sorts. But how else are we gonna get the hell out of here? Prove we're not dead. Although, if it turned out we were dead the whole time, I w that would be pretty cool, too. It's kind of a cliche thing, but still, I think it would be sweet. Come on. Yeah, there you are. Alright. This one-two punch is working quite nicely. All the bloods and s heads, not even skulls, heads! Okay. 
that shadow behind me, it, it like reminds me of PT. And so I'm just like, don't turn around. Don't turn around. That's a trap. That's gonna release. Ooh, there's a hanging body. All right, let's just play it cool. Oh, wait, that's a hanging body. That's not a, I thought it was another swinging log thing. Ah, log jam. Hopelessness. Interesting. Despair. There's a theme, isn't there? So that hanging moss. All right, we're going in the water. This could be a terrible idea and awesome all at once. Panic. Yeah, I don't want to go off of that way because it could just fall. We could be dead. Of course, we could already be dead. Now he's just running off. Okay, yeah, let's come back. I like, this is such a cool looking shot. It's just this like mountain of skulls. Slow push in on that. Just look at that. That looks so good. Just the way the light is bound. Ugh, mm. Ender all, you're pretty. And the water just kind of comes back here. Okay. So we may not have died. I don't trust that. That could be a trap trigger of some kind. Right, I'm going to stand up because so far, so far we're okay. What the? We, haven't we been here before? By the gods, everything here looks so similar. It's... It's a damn maze! Oh. Oh, really? We, we should never have left. This will be our doom. I'm thinking he, he's the suppressor. That's my thought right now. He's gonna turn into something at the end of all this and be like, Ah, evil! No, 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 do you see it? All the cells, they're all empty, and there's blood. Oh no, there were people in there just like us. Where are you coming from? There you are. There you are. I'm gonna get a good look. <clears throat> so ghostly kind of figure. Alright, that's cool. That's cool. I suppose you can't open doors, can you? Alright. What do you got? 
friends? Is that what's going on? <clears throat> At one, two. Very bottom. Daddy? I wonder if that's our daddy from the beginning. Oh, mind games, dear readers. Mind games are afoot. Wish I had a torch. We'll say that. That would kind of take away a little bit of the creepiness. Yeah, I don't trust this. See, see those holes? That just tells me something's gonna come flying out. Told you. I'm gonna take remorse, cause why not? All right. <clears throat> All right, onward and upward. I know I said I was gonna get up and walk, but... That's cool. Alright, time to save. I'm not doing my normal save, because I just wanna do it a little bit quicker. Heart. The key to freedom. Okay, why would it tell? Okay. Ouch. Buddy. There we go. I didn't even mean to hit that switch with it, but all right. Fortunate, fortunate accident. We're back at her cell. Oh no, no! Can't you see? We're, we're back where we started. I knew it. It's just useless. The suppressor doesn't want us to leave, and now he will be even angrier when we meet him than than he was before. It. It was a mistake to follow you. you. You're vile. You forced me to do this, and you and you alone. <gasps> just, just, just leave me alone, okay? Just, just go. Fine, we'll go. You're more than welcome to stay here. Now I can't, I can't stand. Wait, there we go, okay. Something about opening a shackle. It's a big hand. <laughs> it's a really big hand. <laughs> Does that open or close? What? Leave me alone! <sighs> the suppressor's punishment. It will be horrible. Yeah, why are you so f afraid of this suppressor? I haven't seen anything. No, you haven't. Because you're blind. The suppressor is here. In every single stone. In every bone. In every drop of blood. And yet you are too blind to see it. 
But I should have known. I mean, what can you expect from someone who has killed his entire family? I followed you because for a brief moment, you made me want to believe, and now you've dragged me into the abyss along with you. No, there isn't. Just look at us. Look at what we are. We are the damned because we are trapped too deeply in the past. And that's why we do not deserve freedom. I understand it. Who are you? A part of me? An illusion? Uh, of course I'm a part of you and you are a part of me. Isn't that obvious? But I should have known you wouldn't understand. You're too weak. You always were. Hmm. Slight confusion, dear reader. Well, let's see if we can sleep for an hour. I'm still here. I'm gonna try something. So you figured it out. <laughs> yes, I am what keeps you in this place. But was it blind rage that made you act, or have you truly understood who I am? Have you understood what drives you and determines your actions? The salt corrodes your skin, and the water filling your lungs is cold. But you still haven't found it, child, have you? 